Greetings everyone, Terror Rising here on behalf of the DMCA Abuse Channel. What you are watching is a story by cable news network reporter Susan Rosen at the Chicago Tea Party tax protest on April 15th, 2009. During this report, Rosen allowed her personal feelings to get in the way of the story and acted in a very unprofessional manner. Rosen was later filmed by the Founding Bloggers Group while being confronted by some protesters after her report was cut short by CNN. The protesters pointed out several fallacies in Rosen's story, and the video also showed Rosen's complete ambivalence to their criticism. The report and later confrontation were edited together and posted on YouTube. CNN, embarrassed by the behavior of their reporter and the potential backlash of pointed and deserved criticism, filed a DMCA against the video and it was removed. It has since been reposted and will be shown in its entirety after this introduction. While CNN has a copyright claim, this video also falls directly under the fair use doctrine and was wrongly taken down. Regardless of political affiliation or leanings, this sort of censoring behavior cannot go unchallenged, especially from a group that knows better than to try to censor others when they enjoy the very free speech they seek to stop. It should be noted that Fox News Channel has a copyright claim on a pair of videos by user Coctopus Prime seen here, but a DMCA has not been filed yet. So this is not a one-sided issue. News organizations like CNN, Fox, and MSNBC and the like should know better than to censor criticism of their stories as they rely entirely on fair use to properly do their job. It is hypocritical and wrong of them to do so. That's why we're reposting this video and strongly urge you to do the same. With that, this is the video that CNN does not want you to see. Let's see, drop the taxes, drop socialism. Okay, let's see, you're here with your two-year-old and you're already in debt. Why are you here today, sir? Because I hear a president say that he believed in what Lincoln stood for. Lincoln's primary thing was he believed that people had the right to liberty and they had the right... Sir, what does this have to do with taxes? What does this have to do with your taxes? Do you realize that you're eligible for a $400... Let me finish my point. Lincoln... Lincoln believed that people had the right to share in the fruits of their own labor and that government should not take it. And we have clearly gotten to that point. Wait, uh, wait. Now, did you know, you know, that, did you know that the state of Lincoln gets $50 billion out of these stimulus? That's $50 billion for this state, sir. Ma'am, 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 I, I, I... Sure. Can you stop this, sir? Hold on. Okay, well, Kira, we'll move on over here. I think you get the general tenor of this. Uh, it's anti-government, anti-CNN, since this is highly promoted by the right-wing conservative network, Fox. And since I can't really hear much more, and I think uh, this is not really family viewing, toss it back to you, Kira. All right, and I know Susan Rosen's having a hard time hearing me, but wow, that is the prime example uh, of what we're following across the country there. Susan... Reserve Bank, and they are getting all of our money. 
our um, kids' money, our grandkids' money. It's not fair. Care. What if someone said, hey, well, your elected officials voted for this stimulus package. They all need to be thrown up. They're all Congress. It's not just, this is not just Democrats. It's not Republicans. It's all of them. All of them. It's Congress. There, Bush voted for all this. Obama voted you, for all of so it. You, it doesn't really matter to you whether it's Republican or Democrat. Absolutely not. And most people who are here do not believe that it's just the Republicans or just the Democrats. So look, and what group are you with that brought you out here? Hey, you want to hear I'm a suburban, self-employed woman. I don't have a group. No, I mean, how did you find out about it then? Oh, it's all over the news. It's all, everyone. We all do. Like online. You know, oh yeah, it's all over it's online. Everywhere. What What do you think the internet is for? Are you trying That's to play right. stupid? You know, you really don't need to be so antagonistic. Well, but you, I, we have watched what you've been doing here, and it's not fair. You're talking to people who are holding signs. I'm you're a the majority of the people here have signs. Did you Did you look at his sign? It's in our field of view. Okay. This is not about well, Republicans and Democrats. This is about the government stealing our money. I didn't say it was about Republicans or Democrats. Well, so, you know, you guys, there are some people coming in. We're not here with you guys. We're not here with you guys. asking, what does this mean? It means you're trying to tell them that you're bad people.